Also this morning, we're following breaking news out of Olivet, where there's been a massive police presence for hours now. That's right, and our Mercedes McKay got to the scene less than two hours ago. And Mercedes, what can you tell us so far? Diamond and Sydney, right now we're live on Olive Boulevard. If you can see this crime scene tape behind me, that's the start of this massive investigation where police have actually blocked off at least one or two blocks of this very busy intersection on Olive Boulevard. I'm going to step aside so you can see what we're working with. This is what the scenes looked like for a while now. As you can see, police from Olivet and St. Louis County are out here this morning and they've shut down several blocks of Olive Boulevard. This map on your screen now gives you an idea of where we are right now in Olivet. The police presence is here on Olive near I-170 at the Oliver Apartments. Here's video of the scene when a five on your side photographer got here just before 1.30 this morning, not long after police did. Now we've been working the scene for hours to learn what happened this morning, but right now investigators are not releasing any information. We do know right now that this massive police presence around the Oliver apartment complex began around 1 this morning. You can see from our video that officers from multiple departments responded to the scene, including Olivet, St. Louis County, Shrewsbury, Barry and Rock Hill. And less than an hour ago, we did see officers talking to multiple witnesses inside their police cruisers. This morning I have spoken to police. We're still trying to get information from Olivet and St. Louis County. We're hoping to learn more in the next 30 minutes or so. We're going to continue to stay on this scene and report the latest information. Live in Olivet, Mercedes McKay, five on your side.